Well, my first takeaway is that it is a long season, so settle down. <laughs> we live in a day and age of instant reactions, and the mm -hmm. more emotional it seems like, the more yeah. uh, tread that that re reaction gains on social media. Absolutely. LSU and Florida fans were about to lose their minds after dropping their openers. Yep. But both those teams have made a 180 since then. Uh, Florida with a, a huge convincing win over Tennessee. I mean, 29 to yep. 16, that didn't exactly go down to the wire. Billy exactly. Napier is, is he's a good coach. He's, he's riding the ship. It's still going to take some time, mm -hmm. but I like, uh, you always like to see a team improve. LSU yep. the same way after that devastating loss where they just did not look good at all against Florida State. We didn't know anything after they, they beat up on Grambling State, but going down to Starkville for an early start, which historically LSU has done horrible at 11 a.m. starts. Mm -hmm. Brian mm -hmm. Kelly, he, he punched the right buttons, and they came ready to play a, a very convincing win in Starkville. It looks like LSU has righted the ship. So in a long season like this, it's important not – to get too high and not to get too low after the most recent game because there's a lot of football to be played.